Hey everyone, I'm back with another video and today is going to be a haul video. Um, I've purchased like a lot, a lot of stuff off of Ali and I just have not had time to uh, do videos on them or play with a lot of it. So I'm just going to start doing some videos on what I've got and uh, I'll try and put the links down below. I'm not sure how that works. I mean, I know how to add links, but I'm not sure how many links I'm going to be able to add with the video. So if they're not in the actual description, then I'll put them in the comment section um, if I'm able to. And I'll probably break this video up into different parts. So if it ends abruptly, that just means that I've cut the video off and I'm going to do a second or a third part to it. So I'll just get started. So um, some of this is scrappy stuff. Most of it is scrappy stuff. Some of it is not. I'll try and do the non-scrappy items first. Um, so I get my nails done and uh, these stickers like for your nails were super cheap. So I got some. Uh, um, they're not the greatest quality, but they are like 35 cents. So not a big deal. So there's these little dream catchers. Um, little, they almost look like dandelions. This one had a bunch of different ones on it. My fingernails are quite small though, so, you know, it's hard to tell how big these are when you order them. But like I said, they were super cheap. So, um, when I go to get my nails done, I try to remember to bring some of them. Um, I've used these ones. I gave some to my nail person. They, they work not too bad. Um, these little penguins. More little dream catchers, and then these are like a kind of like a Scandinavian almost look to them Christmas ones. So yeah, and a lot of these I ordered during their 11-11 um, um, sale. So and uh, I'll. If I can't find a link for something, if something is sold out or no longer available, I know there are a few things I did look up that are no longer available. I can't remember off the top of the head, off of my head which they were, but I'll try to add those that they're not available. I got this little um, pop thing for my phone. It's got a unicorn on it and it says uh, be magical on it. Uh, sorry for the printing. I got this little... Um, change purse almost. It says time to be a unicorn. It's kind of cute. Um, this one as well. I can't remember if these were a set or individual. This one also has unicorns on them. I thought my granddaughter would maybe like one of those. I thought this was cute. It's a, like a little change purse. Kind of rubbery. Uh, in this one here. Uh, I got this set of little paper clips with the little unicorns on them. Super cute. Um, this little ale, all or whatever, all, not ale. That's something you drink. Um, like to poke holes. Thought this would come in handy. And I think it was like a buck or two. This little stand for my phone. <laughs> it looks kind of ghetto, but it actually uh, works um, pretty good, actually. So, yeah, you like put your phone in there. Well, it won't work because I have a bit of my. There, there we go. Yeah. So, like when I want to read and stuff when I'm at a restaurant or somewhere, because I go to a lot of places by myself and I want to read or whatever, it kind of holds my phone up so I can read. Um, these little um, things you put them on your keys so you can you know pick out your mail keys say from your house key that's on a, a ring of different keys so I got a Hello Kitty one and this little owl one and then I got these I thought they were cute for my boys um, a Batman and a Spider-Man and then this is to kind of clip your like cables together so they're not kind of like all unwound. It's a little Hello Kitty. And then I think the last of the non 
kind of scrappy stuff is this uh, pen. It's a little unicorn pen. And, uh, yeah. So, got that. And now we'll get into the kind of more scrappy things. Um, this, out of all the things I bought, I'd say this is my only dud, which isn't bad considering all the things I got and maybe the nail things. Um, so it's, it was like, I don't know, I want to say it was a dollar or two. I think I wrote the prices down for some stuff. Let's see if I can find it. Uh, sorry, I'm just trying to find the end of the bag here. Uh, yeah, so it's like a bag of just assorted stuff. It's really junky looking. There's a few good things in there. Like um, these are kind of pretty. They're little hearts. And uh, maybe these, but they're really, um, like they are, you know they're plastic, but they're like really plastic looking, if that makes sense. So yeah, those, I'll probably give these to my granddaughter and she can use them in her scrapbooking. So yeah, so that was probably the only dud I got. Uh, I got this set of die cuts. And um, here's what they come with. And I'll... Uh, Open it up real quick and just show you the quality. They're, they're good quality. I think I think they're actually stickers, but let me just double check. They might not be. Mm. No, I don't think they are stickers, but they kind of have a bit of a plasticky feel to them. But they're they're good quality. Like they're not cheap looking. Um, this one has foiling on it. A butterfly, um, flower, shine. As you can see, it's the, the foiling is quite shiny. It's not dull looking. So I, I thought this had some cute images in it. I like the color palette. This little bird is adorable. Um, some cactus feathers. So, you know, on point with um, the... Uh, images and stuff you know it's current stuff I like that heart this butterfly is really pretty I like the camera yeah so yeah I thought that was a thought that was a good deal um, you know price wise is it as cheap as like going to your local store I don't know but I don't have a local store around me anymore I have to drive at least two hours to get to a decent store so you know there's that for me uh, sequins let's see what were the prices of the sequins they ranged about 250 um, per pack which I didn't think was bad so there's these ones here and I like the bag that they come in you know if you don't want to store them in something else they they are you know, a good durable bag or like a, a Ziploc. These, you know, these are plastic too, but compared to those other ones, these are just better quality. So I forget how many you get of these, but there's some um, various sizes. So I, I was really happy with that purchase. These I thought were really pretty. It's just like a sequin mix and it's got um, stars, flowers, um, seashells, and then kind of a clear kind of pink um, sequin and then a kind of transparent flower sequin and then um, ones that aren't clear and then little seed beads as well so I thought that was pretty and that I thought I wrote down the price of that but maybe not yeah can't find oh I think those were a dollar 61 so that's not bad um, these are little uh, bead caps and I was gonna have a container to put um, a lot of this stuff in maybe not the sequins I think I'm gonna keep those in the bag but I I thought about putting them in the container ahead of time so you didn't have to hear this crinkling but then you don't get to really see the um, amount you get right if I put them in the container it's kind of hard to see so 
So these are assorted um, bead caps, different shapes and sizes. Um, good quality. They're not like flimsy or anything. And um, yeah. And they're like a copper, more bronze, I guess, not a copper. But yeah, those were, a, I thought, a good deal. Um, not sure if I wrote down the price for those. Oh, bead caps, uh, $2.22, and that's Canadian. Um, okay, these sequins, they're um, silver, a really light pink, and black hearts, all different shapes. Or sizes, not shapes. Uh, these are unicorn head sequins and all different colors. Very pretty. Um, and you get a good amount of each of them. Um, again, in the in the good bags that seal. These are um, little Christmas tree, and they're silver. And these are reindeer. The whole reindeer which I thought were really pretty and they're in silver as well. Okay then I bought some of these and I actually was uh, watching a uh, video by Scrap Diva 29 and she showed these but I had already gotten these so I was ahead of Erica which is amazing because she usually finds all the great things but I've had these in my stash for quite a while and I've used quite a few of them. Uh, let me see did I bring that up here? Oh, yeah. I used a bunch of them um, for um, these, what are they? Gift card holders I made. Yeah, so you put the gift card in here. And then I, when I went to decorate it, I added the little snowflake right there. So, yeah, um, these are a great deal. Like these, I was really happy with. And I'll probably buy some more because I really like them a lot. And I think you get 200. So, yeah, great they didn't come in this Ziploc bag. I put them in there. Um, uh, let's see, what else? Oh, um, these unicorn stickers. They're puffy stickers. They're adorable. I forget how much these were. Like a couple bucks Canadian. I thought those were really cute. This was a set of stickers. And I'm not sure on the price of these. Um, really nice quality. And um, like lots of cute images. So, like I said, these come in a set of four, and I want to say they were five dollars, which I didn't think was bad at all. And there's gold foiling on um, each set. Uh, this was a pad of paper, and um, it comes loose, like it's not like a bound pad of paper and they're single sided. Um, they're not super thick but they're not like paper thin either. Um, so there's foxes and the little fox heads. I thought this one was really cute. The trees. I love this one. It's got the foxes and this one too is cute. I thought they were it was a really nice set. I really like that one. That one's pretty as well. I thought this would be make cute cards. I have that um, punch and stamp set, the fox that I bought from Stamping Up. So I thought this would be a good um, addition to it. And then more trees and kind of a burnt orange. And then that one. So yeah, I thought that was a good um, deal. Oh, what else? Oh, I got these uh, twine or not twines, tulle. I got this color, and then I got a mint colored one too. I forgot to grab it, but um, it's got little like rhinestones on it, but they're flat, like a sequin almost. Really pretty, and you get a a good chunk of it. So that was a great deal, I thought. And then um, I just thought I'd show you how I'm going to store this kind of stuff. So this you can buy at uh, Michael's or I think even Walmart has them or has had them. And they're I think they're meant for beads or charms. 
and um, I have quite a few of these in my room. I like that they really snap tight shut and they just have tons of compartments so I'm going to put a lot of my stuff in these kinds of containers and I may just um, have one that's just for alley embellishments and kind of just keep them all together. So that's what I plan on storing those kind of little things in other than the sequins. Okay, uh, I think I'll stop the video here because it looks like my battery needs to recharge and then I will add um, the second part to this of non kind of stamp and die stuff that's scrappy stuff and then I have a whole whack load of uh, stamps to show you lots of stamps and lots of dies so uh, I'll be back with those videos uh, take care and see you in a bit